Hello everyone, I'm back with a new video. In this, I'm going to show you how you can write electronic configuration of an elements 1 to 20. This is Nisha Chauhan and you're watching Learn with Fun. In last video, I have shared a power rule to write electronic configuration. If you have not seen that video, you just go in my playlist and you can watch. That is part 1 and this is part 2. Electronic configuration of element 1 to 20. What is electronic configuration, my dear student? Distribution of electrons in the shells. It's called electronic configuration. So that electronic configuration we will write here. It's above method. This is above method and this I have already explained in my last video. So I will not explain here. So there are four subshell S, P, D, F and you know that these subshell can occupy electrons. So S subshell can occupy two electrons, P may six electron fill hote hain, D may ten electron fill hote hain and F may fourteen electrons fill hote hain. So 1S2, 2S2, 2P, 3S, 3P, 4S and this way this goes on. So this formula we will apply here for the electronic configuration and this formula came from here 1s, 2s, 2p, 3s, 3p, 4s, 3d, 4p, 5s and the electron filling goes from lower energy level to higher energy level. It means this 1s uh, subshell is having lowest energy. This subshell is having little bit higher energy. This subshell is having little bit more higher energy and this goes on. So this is electronic configuration. Atomic number 1 to 20 I have written here. These all are elements name. These are the symbols. So let's start writing electronic configuration. And you know that an exam, the examiner will ask you to write the electronic configuration of any element. That time you will be needing this formula to write the electronic configuration. And it's very important question as the exam point of view. So atomic number one, element name hydrogen, symbol H. Helium, uh, helium HE, lithium Li, beryllium BE, boron B, carbon C, nitrogen N, oxygen O, fluorine F, neon NE, sodium Na, magnesium Mg, aluminum Al, silicon Si, phosphorus P, sulfur S, chlorine Cl, argon Ar, potassium K, calcium Ca. So these are the symbols of an elements. So Let's write the electronic configuration of hydrogen with the help of this formula. You know that hydrogen is having one electron and this one electron will go in first subshell. So let's write one is the number of shells. This S is the number of subshell and how many electrons are there? One electron. So that one electron will come here. So it shows that this is the number of shell, this is the number of subshell and this is the number of electron. So every time we fill electron here. So this subshell is the lowest energy level subshell. Let's so come on to the helium. Helium is having two electrons. So the formula will be 1 S 2. So this is two electron. Come on to the lithium. Lithium is having three electrons. So the formula will be 1 S 2. How many are left out of three? One. And that one will go in this 2 S subshell. So this is the configuration for lithium. Come on to the beryllium. Beryllium is having four electron. So the formula will be 1s2. How many are left? Two are left and that two will go in this 2s2. Come on to the boron. Boron is having five electron. Then formula will be 1s2, 2s2. How many electrons are there? Two, two, four. How many are left? One and that one will go in this subshell that is 2p. So this I have to write here. So this is the electronic configuration for boron. This is for carbon. Let's write for carbon. 1s2. Carbon is having 6 electron. So 1s2 will occupy 2 electron. 2s2 will occupy 2 electron. Then how many are left? 2 are left. And that 2 electrons will go in this again 2p. So let's write 2p. 2, 2, 2, 6. So this is the electronic configuration for carbon. Come on to the nitrogen. 1s2. 2s2. 2, 2p, how many are left? 3 are left. That 3 will go in this p subshell. So come on to oxygen, 1s2, 2s2, how many are left? 4 are left and that 4 will go in this p subshell. So come on to fluorine, fluorine is having 9 electron, that 9 electron will fill in this 1s2, 
2s2, 2p, how many are left? 5 are left. That 5 will go in this. Come on to the neon. 1s2, 2s2, 2p, how many are left? 6 are left. That 6 will go in P subshell. So, this is the electronic configuration for neon. Come on to the sodium. Now, sodium is having 11 electron. So, 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, how many are left? 1 are left. And that 1 electron will go in this 3s subshell. So, 3s1. Come on to the magnesium. Magnesium is having 12 electron. How we can fill 12 electron? 1s2. 2s2, 2p6, how many are left? 10, 2 plus 2, 4, 4 plus 6, 10. And how many are left? 2. That 2 electron will go in this 3s2. This way electron fills. Come on to the aluminium. Aluminium is having 13 electron. So 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, how many are left? 3 are left. That 3 electron will distribute like this. 2 fills here. 1 is left, that 1 will go in this 3P1. So, this is the electronic configuration for aluminium. Come on to the silicon. Silicon is having 14 electrons. And you know that how we can fill 14 electrons. 1S2, 2S2, 2P6, 3S2. How many? 3P. How many are left? 4 are left and that means 2 will come here. 2 plus 2, 4. 4 plus 6, 10. 10 plus 2, 12. 12 plus 2, 14. Come on to the phosphorus. 15 electrons are there in the phosphorus. So, we will write 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p, 2 plus 2, 4. 4 plus 6, 10. 10 plus 2, 12. How many are left? 3 are left. That 3 will go in this P subshell. Come on to the sulfur. 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2. And how many are left? After this 12 electron, 4 are left. And that 4 will go in this P. Come on to the chlorine. 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2. And how many are left? After 12, 5 are left. That 5 will go in this P subshell. Come on to the argon. 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2. How many are left out of 18? These all are 12. Out of 18, how many are left? 6 are left. It means all 6 will go in this P subshell. Come on to the potassium. 1s2, 2s2. 2p6, 3s2. These all are 12 electrons. How many are left out of 19? How many are left? 6. These all are 18. And the last one will go in 4s. So, 4s1. This is the electronic configuration for potassium. Come on to the calcium. 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6 and the last two electron will go in 4s2. So I hope you all have find this video interesting. If you find this video interesting, please share and subscribe.